good morning everybody how are you doing today i wanted to come on here this morning and just give you a brief word of encouragement how was everybody weekend let's start off with that how was your weekend this morning this weekend my weekend was great it was fine i worked this weekend and i'm tired how you all like my glasses they're cute they miss my little shirt my little pink but anyway i want to start off this morning with I think my topic this morning is going to be miracle and mercy. You know how you wake up every morning, you you, you hit your alarm clock, or you just wake up because your internal alarm clock goes off, and you just wake up because you used to waking up for years at the same time, and you get up, you do your daily routine, you go to the bathroom, use the toilet, brush your teeth, take a shower, comb your hair, put your makeup on, whatever, guys, you shave, you know. No one ever thinks of that being a miracle. You know, we take it for granted that, well, you know, God gave us life. We wake up every day. We just do the same routine and you wake up. Some people feel like they wake up in their power. But if it had not been for the mercy of God, a lot of us would not have waken up this morning, you know? And I consider that to be a miracle because we don't give ourselves life. We don't give ourselves health we didn't breathe life into our nostrils you know god did that and without him we couldn't be getting up in the mornings going to our jobs and you know going to school college you know so i just want to say i think that's a miracle in itself that we get up every morning you know it's a miracle that he calls us and he wakes us up you know we think it's our internal alarm clock. We think it that we're hitting the alarm clock button to get up in the morning. But the Lord is calling us forth every morning like he called Lazarus from the grave. He's calling us every morning. Or if you work at night, he's waking you up every night. Whenever you wake up, whether it's just to go to the bathroom, he still woke us up. You know, you might have to go to the bathroom at 3 o'clock in the morning and you get the urge to go to the bathroom. But... You could lay there and just don't get up, have the urge all day long because all night long, excuse me, without the miracle and the mercy of God getting us up to go to the bathroom, to toilet at three o'clock in the morning. So it's still a, it's a, it's a miracle and it's by the grace and the mercy of God that we get up, you know? So I'm encouraging you to look at it, not as being in your own power, but the grace and the mercy of God. And it's a miracle. Because we did not form ourselves. You know? He breathed life into man's nostrils. And that's how we are breathing and living beings today. Because of the mercy and the grace of God. That was a miracle. Something that no one else can do. Can no one give you life. Your mother and father can conceive you. But they can't give you life. Because a lot of babies are stillborn. It's not in our power to live. It's not in our power to get up in the mornings and go to work and drive this vehicle, you know, and be in our right mind. That's all the mercy and the grace of God. And it's a miracle that happens every day until it's time for you to leave this world. It's a miracle. It's nothing that's happening by chance. It's not happening on our own. You know, so I want to leave that with you this morning and encourage you to look at life differently starting today. And like I said in the previous video, live your life today. Let it be your best life today. Living your life like it's golden, like the girl singing on the song. Living your life like it's golden one day at a time. Okay, so with that being said, I'm going to leave you all. I may come back this evening with a haul because I didn't get to do it this weekend. I worked and I was just busy. But I may come back this evening with a haul and then maybe next weekend I'll show you a room that I finished in the house. And um, I hope you all are encouraged today. I hope you all are liking my videos. I hope you all are liking my different sunglasses that I've collected over the years. These are the pink with the pink rhinestones, you know. And um just have a good Monday. I know it's hard getting up, going to work on a Monday, but have a good Monday, and I'll see you all this afternoon. Take care.